welcome back to FNAF Sister Location. I got OBS to finally work properly. We're just getting straight into the Go point. Forward. Access granted. So there's an Easter egg that I found out while doing research. It seems that you have accidentally wandered into a restricted area. Due to the sensitive nature of the materials that you may be exposed to here, you will not be allowed to leave huh. until the cleanup crew arrives at 6 a.m. So hang tight. Rest assured that you will be promptly rescued, fired, then sent home. Thank you for being an employee. We hope that your experience has not been as regrettable as ours. Trust it. I thought I did everything right. We don't want to hurt anyone, but we need you. Too scared of dying. If they find us like this, we won't be able to try again. You must help us. You must let us inside the room. You must let us.
What was that sound? That was clearly not entered. I don't get it. I... Who is saying hello? Motion trigger, parts and service. Great job reaching parts and service. Circus Baby has been deactivated for an unknown reason. It's your job to make sure she is structurally stable and secured to the conveyor. Our technicians will take it from there. There is a passcode that you must enter before you can retrieve me. Enter the code carefully. Four, six, nine, seven, seven, one, five, five, four, three, good, a hat. Now you must Instructions in fun time auto go forward. Access granted. It seems that you have accidentally wandered into a restricted area. Due to the sensitive nature of the materials that you may be exposed to here, you will not be allowed to leave until the cleanup crew arrives at 6 a.m. So hang tight. Rest assured that you will be promptly rescued, fired, then sent home. Thank you for being an employee. We hope that your experience has not been as regrettable as ours.
Indeed, I if you are not under cameras for too long.
dead again. So you always die in an instant, no matter how far away in there it is. I will be back. Okay, we attempted some of uh, the private room in FNAF's location. We could not do it, so welcome to FNAF P3 Simulator. There will be some of this location in this video. But this will be an official FNAF P3 Simulator video. The beginning of the series. in the world what begin tape leaving dead space three two one. The purpose of this tape is to test automated response times and reactions from vintage interactive attractions following audio stimuli. If you are playing this tape, that means that not only have you been checking outside at the end of every shift, as you were instructed to do, but also that you have found something that meets the criteria of your special obligations under paragraph 4. Follow these instructions, 
document response times, then safely secure the space before leaving. Upon sealing the room, you are not to return. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Document results. Begin audio prompt in three. What? Two. One. It's a new day. It's your time to shine. It's time to take your career into your own hands. You've saved money your whole life. Great. Now it's time to put all your eggs into one basket and take a huge gamble on your future. A gamble that comes with a 100% chance of success in some cases. What are we talking about? Him. We're talking about becoming a Fazbear Entertainment franchisee. That's right, restaurant ownership and management. Something almost anyone can do with a limited degree of success. Sure, it's a lot of money to invest, but everyone's doing it. And that means it's safe and lucrative. With your initial investment, you'll receive everything you need to get started, including a small room, some tables, and electricity. But don't forget about the money you had left over after buying your franchise package. Use it to decorate, buy a stage, buy attractions and animatronics, and much, much more. Now, let's take a look at a few things that will help you get started as a Fazbear Entertainment franchisee, such as atmosphere, Making sure your establishment has an inviting atmosphere is essential to bringing in new customers. Entertainment. Having a lot of entertainment value in your restaurant will ensure that customers come back. Bonus revenue. Coin-operated games and attractions can generate additional revenue during the day, which means more money in your pocket, ready for reinvestment. Health and safety. There may be times when you purchase something of questionable quality, and we don't blame you. Cutting corners is just good business. But there are steps you can take to ensure you don't get sued for it. And that brings us to liability. Being a thrifty shopper is smart, but be aware that buying things on sale comes with a certain amount of risk. Aside from the daily risk of lawsuits, there's also the risk that something might be hiding inside whatever you just purchased with that steeply discounted price tag. Of course, that would only be a serious danger if there were something outside that's been trying to get in for months now, which we are not confirming to be the case. This concludes the amount of help we are legally obligated to provide. Remember, you are now the face of the newly rebranded Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Wear that smile with pride and let's make some money. Fazbear Entertainment is not responsible for disappearance, death or dismemberment. Hmm. How to A to step guide How to a stu a two step guide to restaurant management. Use catalog catalog mode to purchase items, animatronics and other supplies. Use blueprint mode to place items, upgrade items and upgrade your floor plan. Let's get started. Let's see how much cash you had left over after purchasing your franchise package. Great, that should be more than enough. Now let's get started. On your left are your product catalogs. You can unlock more expensive catalogs by simply purchasing items for your pizzeria. Use the arrows in the bottom right of the item window to browse the products for each catalog. 
When you're finished shopping, click the button labeled Blueprint Mode to place your items. You can switch back and forth between Catalog Mode and Blueprint Mode as often as you like before opening your doors to the public. When you're ready to open your restaurant for business for the day, click the button labeled Finished in Blueprint Mode. Give it a try and do some shopping. Liability. Why do I have a volume? Wait, what did I do? Your restaurant is now officially open. Awesome! That doesn't mean your job is finished, however. You have a lot of work to do while patrons eat their pizza in the other room. From your terminal, you have supplies to buy, papers to print, and repairs to make. Once you've taken care of all the items on your to-do list, you can log off for the day and get out of there. Money for supplies and repairs comes out of petty cash, so don't worry about it coming out of your pocket. We've got you covered. The only money you have to worry about is if you choose to upgrade any of the equipment in your office. Now, on to other matters. Something to be aware of is that the ventilation system and your terminal are pretty loud and may prevent you from hearing things in adjoining air vents. That won't be a problem if there is nothing in the vents. However, if you feel that something might be in the vents, you have a few tools at your disposal to protect yourself. You can shut off your terminal and the ventilation system at any time to decrease the amount of attention you are drawing to yourself. Also, shining your light directly into a vent will most likely prevent anything from jumping out. You also have three tools available from the terminal itself. There is a motion detector, an audio decoy, and a secondary ventilation unit. Keep in mind, however, that you can only have one of these active at any given time. Now get to it. Simply log off when you've completed your tasks for the day, and you can go get some coffee.
that scared me. Oh my god. Why is it taking so long? I played this before and on this night I died to Molten Freddy.
Great job. It looks like you're getting the hang of this. Now let's just focus on getting you through your first week. There's a big party here Saturday, and you should view that day as your ultimate test. Make it through Saturday, and you will have proven yourself as the successful entrepreneur that we all know you can be. Congratulations on completing your first day. However, your job isn't over just yet. There is another aspect to your end-of-day routine, and that is inspecting and salvaging any animatronics Molten found in the alley Freddy? outside the back door. Things are found here quite often, and while we aren't sure why, what we do know is that they can be used for parts, which can mean a much-needed revenue boost before starting your next day. Of course, as with everything else in this line of work, those benefits come with risk. The safest thing to do is to throw it back outside, but then you get no money for the salvage. Choose to keep it, and you run the risk of certain negative consequences, namely death, should the item in question not be as docile <coughs> as it first appeared. If you do decide to try to salvage it, then you must complete the maintenance checklist. During this testing phase, check on the animatronic frequently. If you feel that it is becoming unstable, use the taser provided to you. You can use it three times without damaging the hardware. Every use over three, however, will decrease the item's salvage value. Before you is an animatronic found in the back alley. We are unsure of its origins. It is your job to complete the maintenance checklist before claiming it as salvage, or if you choose to, you can throw it back into the alley where you found it and forfeit payment. Please make your choice now. You have chosen to proceed with the maintenance checklist. Remember, use your company-issued taser to return the animatronic to a neutral state if you feel that it's becoming unstable or aggressive. You can only use it three times before it begins to damage the animatronic and decrease its value. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Document results. Begin audio prompt in it three, like two, move, one. <laughs> Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Document results. Begin. Oh my gosh. An audio prompt in three, two, one. Document results. You have completed the maintenance checklist and may proceed oh with the salvage. Gosh. Well done. End tape. Thanks for letting me join the party. I'll try not to disappoint. Okay, that still has a liability.
Okay, have no liability risk. liability Thank you. 
I'm gonna have to end the video here. Hopefully, OBS actually worked because while I was testing it, it seemed to have not glitched. Therefore, I told it four minutes. I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave a like if you did. We are aiming for 100 subscribers, so please subscribe. On top of that, turn on notifications so you don't ever miss one of my videos. In the, the, in the description of every one of my videos, you can see upcoming series, whatever, I don't know. That may be changed in the future. We may return to this location tonight, six. If we can ever beat it on video, but right now we cannot. So I will see you in the next video.